this is all based on high and sort of vibes ish hate that word i like that word let's be honest <laughs> that's just 100 not right but he's some sort of Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to be predicting who is going to be partnered with who on the latest series of Strictly Come Dancing 2022. And it starts this week, so happy Strictly week everybody. And I've actually got tickets to go and see week one of Strictly. This Saturday, live in the studio audience, I am so excited. I've applied the tickets for years and years and years and never won them. Today, I have won them and I am so, so, so excited. So Strictly 2022, watch out. So do expect a video. There will be a full video vlog of what it was like and everything about it. So yeah, welcome back. And this is the Strictly video. So I've been playing Strictly Cupid of who I think is going to be partnered with who. This year has been really difficult because there's loads of new pros and I've just struggled. I say that every single year, but I usually get better. But hey ho, it's time. We're news, we're gonna go. So these are the celebrities taking part on Strictly 2022. I'm very excited, there's so many good names on there. Like I said in my previous video, I'm so excited for Flo East. I think she's definitely gonna be one of my favourites. So big up, Flo East. So celebrity number one is Kim Marsh. Starting with the girls this time. And I think Kim Marsh is gonna be partnered with Graziano. Don't really know why. Just going along with that for now. Okay, celebrity number two is Kay Adams from Loose Women. I'm excited for her. I'm so excited for her. And I think she's going to be partnered with Kai. Just, just, just fancy that, you know. Thought it'd be, thought it'd work. Uh, then we have Jade Adams. I think she's going to be partnered with Katia Jones because there's rumours of the two same, two same sex couples in the season. So I think she is going to be one of them. And I think she'd be great with Katia. Okay, next up, we have Ellie Simmons. I think she'll be partnered with Gorka. He's the smallest male pro, so I feel like that will work best. And yeah, I think they'd be, they'd be a great team together. Next up, we have Ellie Taylor, the comedian. She's going to be brilliant. I think she's very tall, and I think she'll work well with Johannes, who is also very tall. They're both quite funny, so I think they would work well together. So I'm going for Ellie and Johannes. Okay, next up we have Molly Rainford. She's young, she's small, so I think she'll be with Nikita because he worked well with Tilly Ramsey. Tilly Ramsey was young. They kind of suited each other very well, so I'm saying Molly and Nikita. Okay, we have the Queen, Fleur East, my faith. Uh, I think Fleur East is going to be with the new professional Cameron. I kind of did everyone else and left Fleur out, so I feel like this one could be wrong because I think Fleur could be with the variety of people so i don't 100 percent know but i'm going for fleur and Nik nikita fleur and cameron it's literally right in front of me okay, next up we have helen skelton i think she's going to be partnered with neil jones similar high i think they're both quite competitive i think they'd work well as a team we're going for that for now we're going through it, locking it in. And just like that, we've done all the female pros already. So now we're going to move on to the males. We're going to start off with Will Mella, the actor. I think this is all based on height and sort of vibes-ish. hate that word. I like that word. Let's be honest. Uh, I think Will Mella is going to be with Amy Dowden. Similar heights. I think it'll work. Okay, next up we have Richie Anderson. He's tall. I don't think he'll have Johannes. Obviously, he's going to be in the same-sex couple. I think he's going to have Giovanni. I think Giovanni had a massive challenge with Rose. I think he'll be well up for dancing with Richie. And I think they'll do well together. I think it'll work. Okay, next up, we have DJ Tyler West. I think he is going to be with Diane Buswell. Uh, I feel like Diane's one of, like, the younger, down with the kids, sort down with the kids, sort of professional Works really well with Joe Sarg and Dez. So I think another DJ for Diane. And I think she's going to be with Tyler West. Diane Buswell is lovely, by the way. I've met her recently. I can't remember if I mentioned it in my last video. But she is lovely. She's absolutely delightful. She was so nice. So big up Diane Buswell if you're watching. 
Okay, next up we have Matt Goss. I have really struggled with this, so I'm not 100% sure if his is going to be accurate whatsoever. So I did his based on height, and I think he is going to be with Nancy. But that 100% could be wrong. Like this one, I'm really like, I have no idea whatsoever. So it's not very helpful. But hey ho, that's fine. Next up we have Tony Adams. He is very tall, he's six foot three. So he either needed Luba or Nadia. So I'm going with Luba. I think that'll work better. I think she's a little bit taller. And yeah, good challenge for her. Okay, second to last now. These two I have been swapping around like mad because I have a feeling I could be wrong. But I'm going to go through it. So Hamza Yassin, who is like the BBC country file sort of person. <laughs> that's just 100% not right. But he's some sort of adventure, country, wildlife, nature, whatever. Okay. Uh, Hamza Yassin, I think he is going to be with Karen. I think that could work. But I also have the feeling Karen could be with someone else. But I'm locking it in. Hamza and Karen. I'm going through it. So last but not least, we are on James Bai from EastEnders. And I think because of height, he's six foot two, very tall. I think he is going to be with Nadia. And that is everyone on Strictly this year and who I think they're going to be partnered with. In most years, I don't always do very well because I just feel like it's so difficult. And I've not left myself enough time to figure it out. I've left it very last minute. Obviously, Strictly has been delayed because of moments in history that have changed, but Strictly is back this week. I'm very excited. I'm going to be there for week one. The first week, I'm going to see all 15 celebrities dance. I literally cannot believe it. I'm so excited. I'm very, very excited. And yeah, there we have it. This was a very quick... This was a very quick YouTube video and it was a bit messy in parts, but we've done it. Got it out there and it's coming. Also, I don't think I'm going to be able to see anything after this video because I had a little like selfie light and it is so bright and I'm literally going to be seeing stars for the rest of my life. But there we go. It's fine. Got to put in the work for this YouTube channel. It's got to be done. So thank you so much for watching this video. It was crazy and it was very last minute, but we have got there. We have done it. It is done. See you very soon for more Strictly videos. Hope you enjoy this weekend if you're watching Strictly. So on Friday night and Saturday night, two nights of Strictly Come Dancing. We are so lucky. But yeah, enjoy. Thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you definitely for more Strictly videos soon. Adios.